Hi, this is Jim from True Home Solar, and this short video is titled, Why is my electric bill so high? Let's take a look at the electric portion of your monthly utility bill. On the top, it shows you the number of kilowatts you used in your last billing cycle. That KWH acronym is known as kilowatt hours and is used as a billing unit for energy. Okay, there's three types of charges that you should concern yourself with when analyzing your electric bill. The first one, let's look at number one, the billing free charge. This is what your utility charges you just for being a customer. All right, let's look at number two, the supply charges. They cover the cost of generating electricity and they're determined by two factors, the quantity of electricity consumed and the price per kilowatt of electricity. Cost to generate power at power plants continues to increase year after year in a very big way. And finally, number three, the delivery charges. They cover the infrastructure used tr to transfer the energy from its original source directly to your home. In this example, the delivery charges are more than half of the entire monthly electric bill. There are a tremendous amount of fixed costs needed to generate and distribute energy. Our grid and infrastructure is old, it's fragile, it's dilapidated. It's essentially poles holding up poles. Every time you drive by and see a utility worker on a power line, think of all the power lines and all the poles. Think of all the utility workers, the trucks, the insurances, the taxes, the benefits, the fees, the entitlements, and all the other costs that are involved to keep that big wheel turning. And don't forget, these utilities have to continue to grow profits for their shareholders. This is a business, and it's about profitability for them. And what happens when we get hit by another big superstorm, which seems to happen more frequently than not? These superstorms are causing havoc on our infrastructure, and we keep putting band-aids on a broken and fragile system. Costs keep rising. How much more can this camel's back actually take? We're still paying for Hurricane Sandy and other similar devastations across our country. And there is no protection to these increases. However, you can control your own power generation and delivery using cleaner, cheaper, greener price-protected power. There is a reason why this makes sense on so many levels. Thank you.